Headline News Update. Okay, folks, this is Larry Pesavento with the early morning update. Today, early in the afternoon, we've got the S&P is up about uh, oh, 30 points. The Dow Jones is up about 100, and everything else is uh, rather rather quiet today. Uh, the currencies are rather quiet. Uh, gold is quiet. Silver is quiet. The Treasury bonds are down just a little bit. Treasury notes are down just a little bit, but it's still uh, – Still rather quiet uh, today, but, you know, that, that'll that change, of course, by the end of the day or not. Who knows? All we know is it's been a very, very quiet week after we had the big break that occurred on Wednesday. And from that level, you know, anything could occur, you know, from, from any level that you want to figure, I guess, because this is a weekend that is going to be very, very important. Uh, we have the 25th, 21st of uh, January coming up here, and we got Chinese New Year is going to be starting here on Sunday, so it'll be a lot of things happening. There's going to be closed markets in Asia, of course, next week for the uh, Chinese New Year. They always close that, which uh, as they should, because that's a huge, huge uh, uh, holiday over there, so it's very, very important. I was trying to do two things at once here, but evidently we got that out of the way, so we'll see We'll see what happens. Anyway, if you're going to be on my show today to listen to it coming up next, my guest is going to be Norm Winsky of Astro Trends. He's got some important uh, astro dates coming up, which, which are nothing more than normal cycles that are related to the planetary things, and those are all related to the calendar anyway, so that's why it's going to be interesting to see what Norman has to say. He's not right all the time, but he's right most of the time. And so we're going to pay attention to these dates that are coming up here with the Chinese New Year and the other things that are happening. So let's keep that in mind for sure. So just remember, folks, try to help your neighbors if you can. There's still a lot of people out there that are having a lot of trouble, especially the veterans and elderly. Uh, do what you can uh, because God's blessed us with some great things. And so you got to share your wealth because you certainly can't take it with you. So live every day in an attitude of gratitude and may God bless. And stay tuned for Fibonacci 24-7. Trade what you see with yours truly. We'll be right back. <laughs> 